Hi, I'm Joe Serta, President-elect of NAFA Indiana and Chair of this year's Summit. I'm sure many of you are asking yourselves, just exactly what is the Summit and why would I want to spend two days out of my busy schedule to go to Muncie, Indiana in October? That's a good, valid question. If you're going to take the time to spend the money to attend, you need to know what value you are going to get out of it. To be precise, the NAFA Indiana Summit is a gathering not only of your professional organization, but also the finest minds providing the best training and information you will find anywhere. If you don't come away from this meeting with new ideas to expand your business, you did not pay attention. For those of you who have never been to a summit or who have not been to one in a while, let me show you what to expect. We start off with a town hall meeting where your leaders will provide their vision for your professional organization and to take questions and suggestions from you. If you have an idea or suggestion, this is the time and place to bring it up. Then we elect the members who will lead NAFA Indiana for the next year. This again is your chance to have your voice heard and give your input as to who and how NAFA Indiana will be led in the coming year. Following that, we have continuing education focusing on the information needs of our members. Last year we had the three-hour ethics class that is required every two years. This year we'll have two hours of continuing education by Charles Boyd of the Social Security Administration and one hour of CE on credit ratings by author and past president of the National Association of Credit Management, Great Lakes Region, Dan Ridenauer. We have scheduled these speakers both to provide you valuable information you can use personally and in your practices and to help you get the CE credits you need to maintain your license. After the CE, we take a break and then hold our opening reception where we can relax, meet new friends, and reconnect with old ones. But it's more than that. It's an opportunity to share ideas and gain new insights from fellow NAFA members. Then it's off to the banquet hall where we honor our Jack Peckinpah Associate of the Year. That's always a special time because we honor one of our members for a lifetime of achievement and service. This year, it will be even more special because Muncie is Jack's hometown. After the banquet, it's time for more socializing and networking, and Muncie is a great town to do it in. Everything is within walking distance of our hotel, so I know we'll have a good and safe time. Day two, we start off with a great breakfast and time to visit our vendors to learn more about the products and services available to our members. I know I always find a new product or service I want to find out more about. This is a real opportunity to learn about new product lines that will help your clients and add revenue to your business. And of course, we bring in top speakers from around the state and around the country. Past presenters have included legends like Curtis Cloak, Tom Hegna, and Van Mueller, as well as experts on topics of interest to our clients like elder financial abuse, Medicare, and home equity conversion mortgages. Our speakers this year will include Gordon Holmes, who received a standing ovation for his main platform presentation on the special needs planning at Mass Mutual's annual meeting last year. And that ties into the location of our meeting. The hotel and conference center in Muncie is host to the Erskine Green Training Institute, a unique program that trains special needs adults to perform jobs so they can become independent. By holding our meeting there, we are helping to support that program. And isn't that what our industry is all about? Helping our clients become and remain financially independent? We promise if you'll come to the summit this October, you'll have a great and productive time. But don't take my word for it. Let's hear what business and estate planning specialist, Kevin Bontrager of Fort Wayne says about his experience at the summit. The opportunity to, to pick up great sales ideas is here every year is huge. It helps me leapfrog from where I'm at to the next level uh, by simply taking an idea that um, has worked well for someone else and implementing it in my own practice.